Father, Mother God, we ask at this time to bring the highest information and for all of our soul growths. As always, Father, surround us with your love, light, healing, wisdom, and truth. We call forth the energy of Mary Magdalene and Jeshua, the energy of the Holy Family, as we step forward into this frequency of rebirth and resurrection as we move into this new dawning and new rebirth both individually and collectively for our own souls. In this we thank thee, and so it is. Greetings, dear one. Yes, it is I, Joshua. Mary Magdalene is here as well. I say to each of you, dear sons and daughters of the light, that this is a time of rebirth, that yes, you are in the final phases, as they say, of the dawning of the age of Aquarius, as if this is the final stages of what you call your own labor pains of purging energy, emotions, energy that no longer serves you. Indeed, it is of truth that this frequency that is now being brought forth is of great significance for all to receive. For you see, the energy of the fall of Atlantis has affected your current civilization, even if others are not aware of it. There has been a heavy overlay, as they say, of this sadness and the trauma and the devastation of that beloved civilization. And many of you who are receiving this information have been in Atlantis and were there during the fall. And so you are holding on to these, as they say, raw emotions that are coming to be purged. Perhaps you're feeling anger. Perhaps you're feeling sadness. Perhaps you're feeling a sense of loneliness or loss. For today, we, the Holy Family, come to each of you and we place our hands over your heart once again to heal these emotions, to begin to heal these memories, to begin to heal the trauma that has been held within your soul. There is no need to hold on to this frequency any longer, for we are in a new era. We are now bringing forth what we call the era of peace onto your planet. It is of great importance that each of you stand tall and stand proud and be not afraid, for it is of great importance that you allow yourself to go through this birthing process, this final stage of pushing You may be feeling mentally, emotionally, physically, or energetically tired or strained or exhausted or physically be in pain. You may be emotionally in pain, mentally in pain. And so we ask you to hold on as they say, just like the final stages giving birth before the new baby and the new blessing arrives. You're in this final push, as they say, of clearing your own emotional debris and energy from this time of Atlantis. For many of you have held on to the belief that this, that there is fear, as they say, held within your consciousness, that this could happen again. And because of the current circumstances of your society, you are feeling this sense of vulnerability feeling this sense of unrest. And so today we ask you to allow us to place our hands over your heart and begin to heal those deep-seated wounds of the past. And so today as you allow yourself to breathe, breathe in the energy of the white light of God, breathing in the energy of peace, breathing in the energy of tranquility, breathing in the energy of hope and renewal. And so I ask you at this time, if you so shall, If you are ready, please take a deep breath and simply allow my mother and my Mary and myself to begin to heal from you the raw emotions that are affecting you at this time that are now ready to be healed and purged from your soul. And so, dearest ones, we ask you to breathe breathing in the golden ray of the white light of God, 
Breathing in the golden ray of the light, white light of God. Breathing in the golden ray of the light, white light of God. And simply allowing this energy now to be infused upon your soul as a healing balm. So all of you will begin to feel, sense, and know what we call the vibration of peace. And just as we spoke about this in our gathering, the time and the frequency and the energy and the vibration of peace is bringing a healing balm over this planet. Peace, peace, peace. This is the era of peace. This is the beginning, as we said, of the age of Aquarius, the era of peace. For many, this frequency has already begun, but for others, they are still struggling with healing the depths of their own emotions, the depths of that which is held within their soul. And so today, as you bring, begin to breathe, breathe in the energy of tranquility, breathe in the energy of hope, breathe in the energy of renewal. And so I ask each of you to stand tall and stand proud and be not afraid. Do not allow yourself to be succumbed to these lower frequencies. For you see, dearest ones, you are the change you wish to see. You are the pioneers. You are the way showers. You are the ground troops, as we say. As I've said this many times before, we know that it is difficult to be in the human body and in the human condition. But today, as you allow yourself to release and let go, know that this time of healing is of great importance. And we are here assisting you so that you no longer suffer. There is no need to suffer. There is only to be peace. And so once again, take a deep breath and breathe in the vibration of peace. Breathe in the vibration of peace. Breathe in the vibration of peace. Letting go, letting God, letting go, letting God. Simply allowing your beautiful light to shine. I now will step back and allow my Mary to speak. And so as I stand with you, please allow me to continue to infuse within your heart the vibration and the energy of peace. And we thank you, Christ. And so it is. Greetings, beloveds. Yes, it is I, Mary Magdalene, as I come into your energy fields. I see the bit of confusion that is held within your own auric, auric field of that which is occurring. This is a very difficult time for many and it is of grave importance that you allow yourself to feel from the depths of your soul and no longer suppress or repress those emotions that have been affecting you since the fall of Atlantis. You say, how can this be? How can I carry this energy with me through lifetime after lifetime? And we say, dearest ones, the soul, as you know it, holds the memories of all that ever was and is. And so during that time of Atlantis, where each of you held the consciousness that the civilization was pure, simple, lovely and divine, again as if you were in heaven and during the height of that civilization when all was in unity, and all lived in oneness. It was heaven on earth. And it was difficult for each of you to understand how your beloved civilization 
could take such a turn. And so this has been held within the soul consciousness. And today, it is time for it to be released, to be acknowledged, to be purged, to be healed. You say how simple this can be. But yes, dearest children, this is our promise and our covenant unto you. We here, the Holy Family, Jeshua, Mother Mary, Joseph, myself, and our Essene family of light are here for all of you. We are here to help you heal and no longer hold this frequency within your essence. It is indeed necessary that all of you who are the way showers and the pioneers and the inspiration for this world live in a state of purity and bliss, harmony and grace. And so today, simply allow yourself to surrender. Surrender, trust, allow and receive. Surrender, trust, allow and receive. Surrender, trust, allow and receive. Allowing your beautiful light to shine. Surrender, trust, allow and receive. Allowing your beautiful light to shine. So now, dearest ones, Mother Mary steps forward, placing her hand over your heart, opening up your deep, 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 compassionate and loving heart, and sending waves and waves of healing to your heart, beginning to heal those raw emotions that are coming forward for all of you to receive. And Jeshua stands beside you, sending you waves and waves of peace within your own auric field. Waves and waves of peace so that your mind, body, and your beautiful spirit can relax and shine as you are the way of the world. Yes, dearest children, you are the way of the world. You are the messengers. You are the pioneers. You are the change you wish to see. And so it begins with you clearing and healing from the very depth of your soul. And so please accept this Regardless of what you understand, this is a beautiful gift being given to you in gratitude at this time of your celebration, of your Thanksgiving that is honored in the United States of America. A time of Thanksgiving, a time of gratitude that each of you have given and given and given and you have served with dedication in honor and grace. You have never given up. You are warriors of spirit. You are pioneers of deep devotion. And so today as you allow yourself to feel this energy and this healing at the very depth of your soul, allow any pain that you are suffering from, mentally, emotionally, physically, or energetically, now be healed. So take another deep breath and allow Mother Mary to come, infusing her energy of compassion and grace and Joshua's energy of peace and Joseph's energy of fortitude and strength. And today I bring you foresight, clarity, so that you are able to see and witness and to visualize the pathway for your new life. For again, dearest ones, 
You are moving, merging in to a new vibration, into a new life, into divine holy grace. And so take a few moments and begin to breathe in this vibration. Breathe in the vibration of peace, compassion, mercy. As you simply surrender and let go and let God. Surrender, let go and let God. Surrender, let go and let God. Surrender, let go and let God. Truly allowing your beautiful light to shine. Surrender, let go and let God. Feeling the presence of love, feeling the presence of peace, feeling the presence of tranquility upon your soul. Letting go, letting God, letting go, letting God, letting go, letting God. Breathing in this freedom, breathing in this divine grace, breathing in this peace, breathing in this tranquility. And so today, as you enter into this divine state of grace, feel the blessings upon your soul that you've been gifted with this healing. Receive it, acknowledge it, trust it, and allow the healing to come forth, to begin to heal the very depths of your soul, the traumas, the wounds, and for all those who are suffering from these emotions of abandonment, loss, grief, sorrow, anger, loneliness, despair. Begin to transmute them now and know that the earth, new earth is rising, the dawning of the age of Aquarius. You are part of this new dawning. And your own physical body, your own soul is being resurrected. You are ascending and shifting and healing letting go letting go and so mother Joshua and Joseph and I stand with you we hold this powerful frequency of divine universal love for all of you to step forward to receive we all stand with you, for we understand the pain and the sorrow. But yes, the loss and the trauma that we went through during Joshua's crucifixion and resurrection. Has been healed within all of us. And so we are here to help you to heal from the time of Atlantis, from the time of the Great Fall. And the current emotions that are affecting each of you in your daily lives that are tied to the past can also now be healed. It is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful energy frequency that is being sent to you at this time. It is pink and blue rays of light mixed with the golden light. They're streaming into your heart to be healed, streaming into your soul, streaming into your consciousness, streaming into all aspects of your being. And so today, as you feel this energy and this essence, trust, surrender, allow and receive. For as you enter into this beautiful, beautiful state of tranquility, know that your heart opens to the essence of peace and the energy of joy and the power of love. Love yourself enough to receive this gift that we bring to you upon this day. Allowing yourself to now clear this. There is no need to suffer. There is no need to be in pain. There is no need to carry on. 
been remembrances of the past that are held within the soul. Each of you are being given, as we've said, this beautiful gift. Because each of you are so important and are so needed upon this planet. Each of you are the change we wish to see. We have given and given and given to each of you. We ask that you receive this with grace. So much has been gifted to you week after week, month after month, year after year. And so we have devoted our time and energy to each of you because you are important, you are valuable, you are loved, and you are our children of light. You're the promise of the future. And so as you hold this frequency now of peace, and allow the healing to occur within you. Be not afraid, be not afraid, be not afraid. Simply trust and know that you are more than deserving of the importance of honoring yourself, loving yourself, and creating that space of love for you to receive is of grand importance. Hold the vibration. Hold the energy, hold the grace. Feel the presence of God's loving light upon your soul. Truly, may the love of God surround you. The power of God protects you. The presence of God watches over you. Wherever you are, God is, and indeed all is well. The timeline now for healing to occur and the birthing of the age of Aquarius has now begun. And you will begin to see massive shifts of consciousness upon this planet into unity consciousness. And you'll begin to see more and more individuals helping their fellow brother and sister. Each one teach one, each one lead one, each one giving their hand to another, each one assisting and helping. And so today, give to yourself and breathe in this vibration that we are bringing to you of peace. Indeed, this is the time of peace. This is the time of reconciliation. This is the time of hope. This is the time of faith. This is the time of renewal. This is the time of rebirth. And so once again, breathe deeply and begin to allow all of your chakras begin to be healed. Breathing into your heart and simply allowing all of your chakras to be healed. Feeling the purity of your soul as you trust and understand that all is in order and all is as it should be. As you allow your beautiful light to shine, this is the time, this is the now, this is the presence of the living light upon your soul. This is the time, this is the now, this is the presence of the living light upon your soul. You are all beautiful stars, shining brightly. And we honor you, we see you, and we respect you for your due diligence, for your patience, for all that you've gone through from lifetime to lifetime, from the inception of your spirit to this moment called now, you've gone through the soul's journey. And today we give you a blessing. We give you the grace and the energy of peace. so that you may begin to feel the power of who you truly are and live from your divine spirit and the essence of all that you are. Go now, my children, with the understanding that all is in order and all is as it should be. 
You are now being prepared, as they say, for the next leg of your journey as you emerge into the year of 2021 with enthusiasm, with hope, with renewal, with clarity, and with peace. And so feel this energy opening up your heart and allow your beautiful light to shine. Surrender, trust, allow, and receive. Surrender, trust, allow, and receive. Surrender, trust, allow, and receive. Allowing your beautiful light to shine. Feel the presence and the energy of the renewal of who you truly are. You are a powerful, powerful spirit. Your soul now has received a blessing, a healing, and divine grace as you now make the choice to move forward and live in peace and tranquility throughout eternity. For this is the gift we give you as a part of the family of light. The Mary, Joseph, Joshua and I hold you precious, as precious jewels within our hands as you are the children in the wish hours again of the dawning of this new age of Aquarius. Go now, my children. Be at peace, be at peace, be at peace and truly know that you are loved. Love beyond measure and love beyond comprehension. Truly know that we stand with you. Go in peace and be still and know that you are loved. We thank you, Mary. We thank you, Joshua. We thank you, the Holy Mother. We thank you, St. Joseph. We thank all the beings of light who have come to be with us as we send our blessings to Mother Earth and to all life forms. May there be peace on Earth as we hold this vibration of peace within our hearts. Thank you, Father, Mother God, for this gift of grace as we thank you and know that we are blessed and honored to receive this powerful healing from the Holy Family upon this day. And this we give our grace, and so it is.